here's what I made for Shabbos this week. It's just me, Justin, and Zach. Zach is home, so it's just the three of us, and we're only eating Friday night dinner at home. We're actually gonna be walking to friends for Shabbos lunch, so I don't have to cook that much food, and I'm really not cooking that much food this week. I know I always say that, but this time I really mean it. Also, if I look like I'm glowing right now, it's because I just got this. This is from Rode, it's the pocket blush, and it looks gorgeous. The color is Spicy Marg, and I actually did a separate video trying it on because I'm a beauty influencer now. No, I'm really not, but like, I'm just having so much fun with it. This pesto chicken just came out of the oven. It looks insanely good. Usually I use dark meat chicken for this, but I really was just so in the mood for chicken breast. I just roasted these little potatoes with olive oil and onion soup mix. Oh my God, they smell so good. I will not be eating one of these now because I would just burn my entire face off if I tried. If you listen hard enough, you can actually hear them. The potatoes cool down enough that I can try them. Mm, they are so creamy. And the last thing I'm making is just some roasted broccoli and cauliflower. Look at all that steam. First soup this week, we have a store-bought chicken soup. And this is a Yemenite soup. I think I might even mix them together. We have lots and lots of pickles to eat. The pineapple. Oh my God, it is so good. Then for a little dessert, we have the glazed chocolate donut holes from Trader Joe's. They are dairy-free and gluten-free. Then some challah rolls that I'm... <laughs> I'm just gonna take these out of the freezer if I can get them out. There you go. I'm gonna make some homemade challah next week for sure. I almost forgot we have a couple store-bought dips. Okay, going into the fridge made me realize that I forgot the oyster steak, so let me make that now. All right, there she is on the stove. 